You're here. Good. I have everything I need to get started. Just one thing before we do. You're the Cloud, right? Cloud the Merc. I'm told you did a wonderful job helping the people of Sector 5. <laughs> you have a very impressive work ethic. It's like they say, good things come to those who work. What goes around comes around, and in ways that might surprise you. <laughs> I'm gonna put Aerith in the most gorgeous dress you've ever seen. <laughs> It'll be a real jaw-dropper. All right, now that that's out of the way, once you change, you won't be able to leave town. Are you sure you're ready? All right then, let's get started. Beauty takes a lot of work and preparation. Far more than you'd know. In the meantime, let me see, let me think. There ought to be things you can only do without your friend. Now's your chance to get out and have some fun. <laughs> I can tell you're already beginning to feel at home here. Though being so new to it, I assumed you still wouldn't know how to enjoy yourself properly. <laughs> so I went and had a chat with Sam. He said he'd be happy to help you out. Hey, no one asked you to do that. But there's so much you don't know. This is the perfect opportunity for you to learn the ways of the world and man the hell up. And that's enough of that. Aerith, come with me. Oh boy, I can't wait to see the dress. The dress is part of it, sure. But we'll also need to do something about that plain Jane makeup and hairdo. This is gonna take some work. Ouch. Well, I'll see you later, Cloud. Peek, and I'll poke out your eyes. Madam M said you'd be swinging by. Let me see if I've got this straight. You ditched your lady friend and fellow champion to have a boys' night out in Wall Market? Ugh. Kidding. If I know the madam, and I do, this was all her idea. I can see why. There's no denying you're skilled with a sword. But when it comes to damn near anything else, well, can't help but have my doubts. Ain't nothing wrong with that. But then there's nothing wrong with expanding your horizons, neither. Seeking new experiences. Knowing the ways of this here world will help you to better protect her while you're in it. Reckon I got a few solid gigs for you. What do you say? You game? Huh. <sighs> yeah. Why not? <laughs> That's the spirit. You have yourself a grand time tonight, Mr. Merck. Never 
Cloud, been waiting for you to show up. Thanks for coming, and welcome to our humble training hall. Jules, head trainer. If you've got some time to spare, how about a little bit of fun? Wanna try taking on one of our guys? <laughs> You're not serious, are you? Look at him! He's a scrawny little thing. I could snap him like a twig. Now, now. I wouldn't judge this one by his muscle mass. No, no muscle what do you say, Cloud? If you want to give it a go, just let me know. So, you up for a round? Endurance and determination. That's what Ha! You're taking me on? You look like a dried up old terpsichold left out in the sun. You got no idea what you're getting into, little man. All right, enough talk. We'll settle this the tried and true traditional way. A squad off. Now, let's all see what you've got. Now don't go crying a month. Not bad at all. That's how it's done. I knew you could do it. You've got this. Come on. Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. You've got this. Come on. I knew you could do it. Not bad at all. That's how it's done. You've got this. Come on. Your form's looking good. I knew you could do it! Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. You've got this, come on! That's how it's done. You've got this, come on! Not bad at all. I knew you could do it! Your form's looking good. I knew you could do it! You've got this, come on! Not bad at all. That it? Ah, how? How the hell did I lose to this scrawny little kid who looks like he doesn't even consume his daily recommended amount of protein? Ronnie, you know it's all about quality, not mass. You're too quick to judge people by their build. That and your overtrained ego are the main reasons you lost to our bold challenger here. Thanks for helping me teach my boys a valuable lesson, and sorry for dragging you into it. Cloud, we're all one big family here at this gym, and now you're part of it. If you're ever up for training, our doors are always open to you. Let's work together to maintain healthy minds and bodies. And this rip took a lot of blood, sweat, and tears. It's yeah. absolutely legendary. <laughs> Welcome. Anything in particular you're looking for? Oh, you must be the Merc I've been hearing about. I need you to help me out with my dad. His drunk ass has been at the bar for hours now. Could you bring him back here? He's probably three sheets in over at Drunkard's. <laughs> Just over there. <laughs> There's nothing more fun than scouring. Mm -hmm. Wait up, Cloud! Sam caught me up on everything. He said you're gonna go rescue Tifa. And to do that, you're trying to learn all about Wall Market. Bro, I know this town like the back of my hand, so I can answer all of your questions. Now, let's go knock this one out. The bar is this way, Cloud. Drunkards, here we come! Mmm, that crunch. Uh, are Can't we even allowed one. to walk the through the door? The more you eat, the better they this get. This is Fresh the Drunkards' Den, the best popcorn. place in Wall Market to drink away your problems. It's mostly the same folks every night, so... 
Whoa, you can't just waltz in there uninvited. Listen, there are rules for this kind of thing. Hey, wait for me! Sing it proud! Hey, old dude! Huh? Son, is that you? Did you always look so moronic? Well, right back at you. Yeah, whatever. We're here to take you back to the store. I'm not going back. Not ever. My life is ruined. It's over. Kill me now. Come on, there's no need to talk like that, old dude. I'll help you out with whatever you need. Really? Oh, thank you, son. See, I made this bet with the Materia Merchant. A sure thing, but then I lost. And so I had no choice but to steal my heart and surrender my precious inspiration. Your precious insp... who with the what now? Inspiration! <laughs> Without it, there's simply no point in me ever going back to the store. Got it. I mean, I don't got it, but... I just need to get your inspiration back, right? Whatever the hell that is. Leave it to me, old dude. Uh, hey, aren't you gonna go with your friend? <sighs> this is my jam. It's basically. Worry about your own health instead of planets. I've never Popcorn here, shape. Like everybody's favorite chocobos. Get them while they're hot. I don't even really know how people use materia. Hey, wait for me! Huh. So this is it, huh? And what do you two want? Uh, uh, I'm here for the precious inspiration you took from the old dude. Inspiration? Oh, that thing. But I didn't take it. I want it fair and square. It's mine by rights now. Well, that's true. But I tell you what. I'll consider giving it back in exchange for... a favor. Uh, what you need? Something only... real men can deliver. Uh. I need you to go and get me something from the vending machine at the inn. You know what. You know. No, I don't think I... Wait. The sauce. The sauce? Stop saying the sauce. Anyway, good luck. The time has come for me to wield my powers of assessment. I can feel... Oh, I can feel it. I'm in for one wild uh -huh. ride. I'm gonna see some weird shit tonight, they call yeah! Themselves bangers. I think this is where they say... See? I have the perfect room for the both of you. Hold on, let me look at the guidebook first. Hey, are you really leaving me out here? You need me! You need my knowledge and expertise to unlock the machine's secrets! This is what I get for being a cheapskate. A room with a hooligan. Oh, shit. Must have fallen asleep or something. That 
That's it. That's the one. It looks like a regular old vending machine, right? But wait. <laughs> you ready for this? All right. This particular model has secret buttons. Where? Well, I can't tell you. It's a secret. You just need to tap into your knowledge and expertise, like grab it and whip it out. And then you'll be able to see everything. I don't need to whip it out. I've done this before. Watch this. Whoa, look at you, bro. Huh? Is this the sauce? I don't know. Come on, bro. You know there are more hidden buttons waiting to be pushed. Oh, so this is the sauce. Neato. You're a winner! Have a prize! Shit, that really scared me. Well, I think we've got what we needed to get. Let's go back and talk to the guy. Uh, is it me or is everyone looking at me? <laughs> so this is what it feels like to be a champ. Oh, it's you two. It's time, bro. The sauce. Hmm? Okay, okay. I see. That's not it? I had higher expectations for you, but I guess you and I aren't so different after all. We both still have a lot to learn. Yeah, I feel you. Oh, right. Hate to break it to you, but that thing you were looking for? Not here. It's long, long gone. You shitting me? Nope. Sorry. As I recall, the guy who runs the restaurant should have it. Ugh. Well, I guess we know where we're headed next. Come on, bro. Well, that's that. Time to polish the old orbs. Give them a spit shine so they positively sparkle. Hey. If you're done here, then get going already. Restaurant up next, huh? Uh, getting kind of hungry, actually. Did you smell that? I think it's coming from over there. Nope, stay focused. We have work to do first. I think this is where they said to meet. Welcome! Feel free to take any open seats. Sorry, we're not here to eat. The Materia guy gave you something, yeah? We want it. Materia guy? Oh, you hear about that? I'm surprised. Didn't take you for the type. Let me ask you something. Either of you know anything about cooking? Nope, never cooked once. That's too bad. For some reason, my food doesn't taste nearly as good as it used to. I was hoping one of you two might be able to help me figure it out. I've narrowed it down to the fridge, the stove, or the power supply. But I'm not sure what's to blame. Man, I seriously have no idea what it could be. This sucks. I've got it. The problem is, the heat's not high enough. Oh? Know a little something about fire, do you? Okay, then. 
Let me try turning it on to see if you're right. Whoa! Hot damn, that's way too high. Someone could get burned your crisp. Here, eat up. Man, this looks great. Stomach pain. Oh, God. It's, it's coming up. Nothing makes a cook's heart sing like seeing a customer's too stuffed to walk. Can't thank you enough. Oh, and here's a voucher along with my gratitude. Get the poor guy some medicine, will you? Drugs. I need all the drugs right now. Out of the way. This material pops right, right here. here. Yes, right here. Dozens of flavors to try, including a miss. Everyone! You have to taste the blizzard. It's like my mouth's a lake of. I saw it. Hey! Off my doorstep, you bum! Sanctuary. Hey, you! This yours? Well. Oh, that about you you got there? Should have said something sooner. Come on in. What is it with today? People are dropping like flies. Besides this dumbass? Ah, loads of them. I got enough outstanding orders to fill a book. I was about to leave and make some deliveries, but... Uh, I'm gonna hurl. Eh, I can't very well leave him alone now, can I? Hey, you're not doing much. Maybe you can deliver that medicine for me. You're what? Military or something, right? Then you must know a thing or two about dealing with the sick and injured. You're a lifesaver, literally. So, let me see. What needs delivery? Here, I need you to deliver both of these. You'll probably find this guy sprawled out on the ground somewhere. But make sure you check his symptoms before giving him meds. So juicy. Hey, I'm talking to you. I said there's... Got meds. Let me take a look at you. Thanks, buddy. Oh, you saved my life. Here, it's not much, but it's yours. No, I'm grateful for your help, but do you think a guy could get a little privacy? house right and it was all like trying to kill him but then cloud was all like beep beep boo your friend fought a house a house oh hey welcome back bro better already yeah and now he won't shut up anyway how'd the deliveries go i did about as much as i could 
That's fair. Still, if you can find the time to deliver the rest, you'd be doing me a pretty big favor. Anyway, I promise to be worth your while. Here, I got something you're definitely gonna like. What is it? Well, it belonged to the owner of the clothing store first. Heard from the cook that you boys been running all over town looking for this. Am I right? Wait, we have? Hold up. What were we doing before all this? Oh, shit! The inspiration! Bingo! You see, all us Walmart entrepreneurs go way back. We get together for a game every night, bet all kinds of stuff. This found its way into the pool and eventually into my possession, and now it's yours, because, hey, why the hell not? It's a VIP card, highly coveted and extremely rare. They're only given to a select few. Not having it is gonna do you much good, but... Holy mother of... No way! Bro, we gotta get to the honey... Er, I, I, I mean, drunkards on the double! Tell the old man I said hi! Come on, bro, get a move on! So that's the old dude's inspiration! Of course, it's so simple! It's got everything under control. Aren't we gonna be late? What heart is beating so fast? Hey, old dude, we're back. Huh? Who are you? You're no son of mine, I think. Special delivery, just for you. Oh, my inspiration! You've returned to me at long last. Yo, is that what I think it is? Oh, you bet it is, and it was hard won. I sew dresses day and night for those ladies until I got what I was after. A Honeybee in VIP card! I knew it! Now make way for the VIP, boys! I don't want to keep my ladies waiting any longer. But first, I should pick up a gift dress. Lead the way, old dude! We are coming! Chocobo bean popcorn. Here, shaped like everybody's favorite chocobo. <sighs> well, thanks for bringing him back. Can't imagine what you went through. Here, you earned it. Hey, you're coming, right, bro? Get ready for a real Walmart education. I'm done with this. You, you can do whatever the hell you want. I get it, bro. You're scared. It's only natural for people to fear the unknown. Uh. It's a pity you're not gonna join us, but I swear to you, bro, as an aspiring Walmart connoisseur, I'm gonna go in there and get as much inspiration as I can handle for you, bro. For you. Because, Cloud, you are my one true bro. Honeybee in, here I come! Inspiration, here I come! <sighs> Perfect example of how age has absolutely nothing to do with maturity. Couldn't agree more. Should probably go see Sam again. So, tell me, what'd you see in our little enclave of sin and debauchery? Bet it was an eye-opening experience. Nothing I haven't seen before. That it for jobs? Not exactly. I got one more favor to ask. You want to get Tifa out, right? What's your angle? <laughs> Just get your ass to the Coliseum. You'll see.
We've been waiting for you, champ! Stands are packed thanks to you. Now get out there and give them a show! Lovers of bloodshed and mayhem, your favorite champion, Cloud, is back in the ring! Right now, this boy may be hot, hot, hot. But look out, folks, because these dynamite challengers may just blow the champ clean off his throne. I hope you brought shades because you're about to see some fireworks. Fighters! Was that hot enough for you, fight fans? Did the champ bring the heat? Indeed he did. He proved there's nothing more explosive than the guns he's packing. Nice going, champ. You were in fine form today. Here's your cut. You earned it. Not here for the cash. Tell me about Tifa. Ah, Tifa. She's something of a bombshell herself, huh? Girl keeps in shape, and boy, does it show. Hey. Just making an observation, that's all. Anyway, 
Seems like you're serious about getting the poor girl out of her predicament. I could tell easy enough by the way you fought back there. Cut to the chase. Well? You helping or not? Never said I would. Opposite, even. Getting mixed up in other people's business isn't my way. Plus, as you are now, I reckon you could ride to her rescue without anybody's help. And that's the truth. You've changed since you first rolled into this here town. For the better. <laughs> At any rate, I've said all I'm gonna say. Your lady friend ought to be done changing by now, am I right? She ain't no Tifa, but she is a firecracker. Keep her waiting too long and she might just blow up in your face. Tonight's champ could take on a soldier and win? Cloud! Finally! <sighs> Tifa! She... I... Tifa! She, she's... I don't... Take a deep breath. What about Tifa? I heard Corneo was gonna audition new girls soon. And Tifa's... Tifa's gonna be... I just... I, I don't know what to do. Well, I do. I'll come too! Hey, Cloud! Bro! I can call you bro, right? Nope. Just want to say, bro, that I'm totally relieved that you're looking out for Tifa. So, like, how'd you get so strong anyway, bro? I said. The way you fight, bro, is like poetry and violence. Bam, bam, whoosh, whoosh, you know? I really wish I could be just like you. Well, this is it for me. Call me crazy, but uh, I have a feeling that I'll just be getting in the way. Go find Aerith at Madame M's. Tell her to wait for me there when she's done. Think you can handle that? Yes, sir! You again? Got a letter of approval right here. Hmm? Huh? You know that's only good for women, right? Yeah, it's for Aerith. Who? Oh, that girl you were with. Sorry to hear that. Well, either way, you're stuck out here, pal. I can't let you in. I wasn't asking for permission. Huh? Wouldn't try it if I were you. Trust me, you don't want to screw with the Don. If you even think about causing any trouble, he'll make sure someone pays for it. And that someone might wind up being the girl you're trying so hard to break out. Or it could wind up being someone you've never even met before. Get it? You're in the Don's world now. Anyway, you've got some time yet. The audition won't start for a while. 
If you're sure you want to go through with this, then bring the girl and the letter. But if I were you, I wouldn't. That's really... Yeah. Corneo's got certain tastes. This dress is so gaudy and impossible to move in. Uh, 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 yeah. Cloud? Uh, uh, excuse me. Huh. Hey, wait a minute. Did Johnny forget to give you my message? The one asking me to stay put? No, I got it. I was worried about you. I'm starting to think this place is more dangerous than we thought. Who knows what they'll ask you to do in this audition? No way in hell I'll let you go in there by yourself. By myself? Oh, don't worry. I wasn't gonna. Come on, you'll see. See what, exactly? According to Madam M, you've caught the eye of a certain fabulous someone and they'd like to meet in person. Huh? Look at you oh, all dolled up and fabulous. Where are you headed? Well, what do we have here? You're quite the pretty little lady. Flower, man. Blooms Time to go. Brilliant. 